there are two qualities that no Muslim has, except they're definitely going to enter Jannah. And he said, they are so easy, but those who do them are so few. He said, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, saying SubhanAllah after every prayer 10 times, and saying Alhamdulillah after every prayer 10 times, and saying Allahu Akbar after every prayer 10 times. And he said, if you do that, that's 150 phrases on the tongue and 1,500 deeds on the scale, on the mizan. And then he said, when you go to bed, you say SubhanAllah 33 times, Alhamdulillah 33 times, and Allahu Akbar 34 times. And he said, that will be 100 on the tongue and 1,000 on the mizan. And he said, who amongst you commits 2,500 sins in one day? If you had those 2,500 good deeds that could wipe out those 2,500 sins, how easy is that? So the Sahaba said, Ya Rasulullah, how come so few of us do it? How do we miss that? And the Prophet ﷺ said that shaitan comes to you while you are praying and he reminds you about things that you've forgotten and he reminds you about things that are coming up. And so what happens is when you finish your prayer, you rush back to whatever you were doing and you skip the dhikr. And then shaitan comes to you when you're about to sleep and then he lulls you to sleep before you can finish saying these simple phrases of dhikr. That's 2,500 good deeds daily that are missed on the mizan, that could literally be the difference maker for you on the day of judgment. And the shaitan really doesn't want you to say these simple phrases because he knows the major impact this has on your scales on that day.